to another. The next stop on our search for bar food paradise takes us to an authentic Irish pub. But it's not in Ireland or even Boston. No, we're heading to Santa Monica, California, home of Finn McCool's, where sand and surf meets Guinness and pub grub. It's an Irish pub at the beach. Come here and enjoy your favorite fish and chips and beer. Beer. I don't know. <laughs> Finn McCool is a mythical Celtic warrior god, known for confounding his enemies with magic, and visitors to the pub bearing his name may find themselves confounded as well. The minute you enter, you feel like you've gone from riding the surf to kissing the Blarney Stone. Celtic art, music, and dance create the atmosphere of a cozy Irish pub right in the heart of Southern California. You come in and all of a sudden you're greeted with that Irish feel. I haven't been to bars that actually have real Irish music that makes you feel like you're in the old times again, you know what I mean? If you're curious about the Irish, this is a really great, authentic kind of environment to experience, and it's fun. The real-life Finn McCool spinning her magic here is this Irish-born owner, Geraldine Gilliland, who painstakingly brought this entire bar over from Ireland, timber by timber, piece by piece. When my stepfather passed away, we had a pub in Northern Ireland called Flynn's, and I wanted to try to take as much of the artifacts out of the pub as possible, so we packed everything up and actually shipped it and reconstructed the pub. And she didn't stop there. She went even further to create an absolutely authentic Irish feel. Pretty much all the staff here came from Ireland. We used a recruiting company, and they all came over on their visas. My name is Rochelle Morrissey. I'm from Madeira in Ireland, down south. I just think it's really important to have a real Irish accent when people come into to the pub. It's a lot of fun working here. It's bananas. Yeah, it's wall to wall. People are, it's jammers. Yeah, you can't, the wheels fall off the bus basically. <laughs> and uh, you better be in the mood to drink because when you come to Finn McCool's, that's what's going to happen. I'm going to make you do it. The drink of choice at Finn McCool's practically qualifies as bar food itself. It's a nice, thick, hearty Guinness. The correct way in serving a pint of Guinness is we serve them all in 19 ounce imperial glasses. Place it at a 45 degree angle. Never let the actual glass hit the actual pour. And as the glass fills, stand it in horizontal position and wait for three minutes for the pint to settle. Guinness was invented in Dublin in 1759, and its distinctive dark brown color and taste comes from unfermented roasted barley. It's the best-selling beer of all time, with 10 million pints consumed in 150 countries every day. And it's best served with their signature potato skins. In well, my opinion, potato skins can't get enough of them. Simple as that. The loaded potato skin was introduced in 1974 by TGI Fridays. But at Finn McCool's, they use a special ingredient that sets them apart from the American version. We put Irish bacon in them, real Irish bacon from Ireland. It's a very lean bacon, it doesn't have any fat on it. It's less salty, less smoked than American bacon. And we start off with some crispy potato skins that we deep fried. And then we're gonna pop some Irish bacon and these are some sautéed mushrooms. The broiler does the rest of the work, and after the cheese is melted and bubbly, Geraldine garnishes the skins with some scallions and yet another very Irish touch. I'm going to top these with a little bit of freshly grated horseradish and like a sour cream. Voila. These are wonderful. Very good. A lot of different flavors in it. Really good. It's perfect. Potatoes, mashed, diced, fried, and roasted are done up here eight ways to Sunday. And don't forget to try the bangers and mash. I'm an Irish girl at heart, so mash spuds can't go wrong. <laughs> I was just living in Ireland, and it tastes like it does there. So it's good. It's really good. Pub food is comfort food. In other words, you wouldn't be on a slimline diet when you come into Finn McCool's. It's like Guinness. It's comforting. It's like putting on a big woolly blanket, so pub food is comforting. I was expecting a little taste of Ireland, actually, so I'm really happy. I met my husband here, and that's how we feel in love, so here you go. Finn McCool's, it's the Irish Rose of Surf City.
We got Guinness flowing and good fish and chips, good energy, good atmosphere. What more can you ask for? Slancha.